pressure was hunted. I said, Rastafari, pressure is speaking my mind. Pressure, what exactly inspired this? Well, just the, the constant social issue that we face, you know what I mean? It's like we talk about it so much behind the scenes and it's like, you know what I mean? We we, we, we want to see a balance, you know what I mean? It's like there's a dark cloud over the industry and the two lights are fighting hard to shine, you know what I mean? So it's better we just make it known what we're facing instead of dealing with it. And, and 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 you know what I mean? Going it becoming a silent issue. It's the elephant in the room. It's a big elephant in the room. And and that is something that we needed to bring to the forefront, you know. Because it's something we talk about all the while. Every time we, there's no balance. I'm never going to fight against no artists and how they express themselves. You know, I want to see a balance of the music that's being played to the masses, you know, because we are the fans. I'm a big fan of reggae music first. So I'm always in the fan standpoint versus the artist standpoint, you know what I mean? So as a fan, I love to listen to dancehall. I love to listen to reggae. I love all of it. But at the same time, you go to a party, there's no balance. There's all the music that's being played is slack music. It's dark and there's very little of light. It's like when they start to play nice reggae music, people start to go to the bar for a drink. People start to use the bathroom. They start to do every little thing they want to do. It's like reggae music become old people music. It become, you know, like recess music. You know, like when reggae come on, it's like, all right, make me go on. Let's go to the bar and buy a drink. Let's go, let's go roll two spliff. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And... That's not where we're coming from. You know what I mean? Reggae music became something that people think is a thing of the past. And you have artists like myself and Sizzler, Anthony B, um, Capleton, enough, enough artists, Loot and Fire, you know, the 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 the, the um enough artists, the perfect Giddy Money, the the the, the Jamison. I could name it. Even the lovers rock artists, you have like Romain Virgo, the Chris Martin, you know, so much to mention, Egyptian them. And the music is not being respected to a level that it it it, it that it used to be. You know? You have so much great music being put out, a lot of artists and musicians spending money on 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 music like me need a guitar man to play upon the shock man for pay the guitar man i for pay the bass man pay the drummy i for pay for studio time i for pay the engineer for mix the song i for sometimes i for pay the artist for vice the song and then when you do all of this and you put out good music it gets put by the wayside because this generation now only feel like what's good what's bad is really good you know what i mean it's like we're so used to violence. We're so used to slack music and the derogatory music. And how can we, as a people, reach so far that this becomes a norm? You understand? This should never be normal. I come from a place when certain things you say will affect you. You understand? Mm -hmm. It will affect people who are scared to say certain things in music. There's no... There's no what you call it, no, 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 um there's no blockage, there's no nothing to say like you can't do this no more or this this can't go on. Right now, there's no rules in music. You know what I mean? And because of that, now you have women coming outside and there there is like they're dressing real extra sexy. And it takes away, you know, it takes away so much from the fun in getting to date a woman. And it's like, you're getting to see all of a woman in a party. First of all, women coming out and it's like they're wearing nothing. And men, they, I, I don't understand where we're at now. I just know where we need to be. And I would like to see a lot of balance back in the music. So for me, I heard the rhythm from Jan Jan. I, I had the rhythm for some months. Jan Jan can tell you, it's like... On, on a weekly basis, Jan Jan check up. He say, yo, pressure, you know, find nothing yet for the rhythm. And I said, no, Jan Jan, we dip on the road, me not even in the studio yet. And it's like, I heard the rhythm a couple times. And the first time I heard the rhythm, it automatically made me want to sing a girl song, sing a song for a female. I listened to it again. 
I'm finding lyrics and stuff, and it's like it's like it's easy for me to sing a song for a female. And then I'm thinking to myself, wait, if I'm feeling this way, then the other artists them on the rhythm probably feel the same way. So that means that everybody on this rhythm gonna want to sing a girl tune. So you know what? Now go trick the rhythm and find something totally different. And within my meds, haunted is what came to Iron Eyes. So it was. When, I, when the meditation first came to me, the concept came to me about speaking facts of what go on in the industry right now. It was like, you know what? You can't do me nothing. The amount of things I go through in the music, right now, I have to speak my mind now. And nobody can tell me nothing. You can't do me nothing. You can't take nothing from me. If you don't like it, go sit down. That was the space of mine I was in. You know, um, you know I like, I don't care if, like, but at the same time, with a lot of care, a lot of love, a lot of heart. But at the same time, like at this point, everybody needs to hear what I have to say. And I'm not going to pretty it up anymore. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm getting straight to the point. Mm -hmm. And that was it. All right. So, Pressure, now I have you on the line. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to introduce the song Haunted whilst I play it. Introducing... Brand new song, Haunted, produced by Jan Jan Records, Fresh Abus Pipe. I'm going to say, no for them, Haunted. Lagazi, squeeze. Oh. 